This is one of our favourite strength-based HIIT workouts. It's set to challenge your heart rate, which we're going to track on our Fitbit Blaze. Let's, Let's kick, kick things, things off with, with a warm-up. These are just some simple movements to get the body moving. And of course, increase the heart rate. Your heart rate should now be in the cardio zone. Time to push it up a level. Exercise one is a landmine squat and overhead press. When the arms go overhead, the heart has to work against gravity to pump blood around the body. This means the heart rate will increase. Explosive movements such as kettlebell swing and box jumps are gonna send that heart rate soaring. This is because you're challenging the body in different ways and with different movements. These types of explosive movements cause your heart rate to fluctuate, whereas when we're performing steady state cardio, such as running, it tends to stay quite consistent. For these walking lunges, once again we see the arms go overhead. This means we're challenging the heart rate again using gravity. All the exercises in this circuit are full body movements. This means we're recruiting a lot of muscles, meaning the body needs more oxygen and the heart has to work harder, meaning the heart rate increases. This type of high intensity training helps to boost our stamina and increase our anaerobic threshold. It really comes in handy when the going gets tough on our 50k runs. And hey, nothing like a bit of healthy competition to see who can get that heart rate back down the quickest.